So how have you been actually since your last visit? And more energy, more focus. Like right when I left here, I had like a ridiculous amount of focus. Like I even went to the grocery store with Cody, and that's something that I normally wouldn't have done after all, like all the work we did. Kind of cool. Yeah, really cool. This is me at 88. I want to get your temperature up. This is okay. a big deal for uh, us in the future. All right, from the top. Let's say you push up. Go. Wonderful. Try again. Go. So our patient was weak on all these tests on her last exam. Push up. Good. Push up. Try that again. Go. And push up. Um, another thing, a friend called me yesterday and said maybe I'm so dizzy because my blood's thin so I'm not getting enough carbs. No, you are dizzy because an area in your brain is not working properly. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. So what does that do that you just popped in my ankle? Any adjustment, neck, jaw, foot, toe, is a <coughs> increased proprioception in the brain. And with you, the reason we need to go slow, so you, you've seen lots of YouTube videos on chiropractic. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, you got the guy that cracks every joint. Yeah, and but it's like some of them come back the next day in a serious amount of pain and they can't move their neck a certain way because these chiropractors are going so hard on them. And for a healthy patient that was a little bit out of whack, you could do that. But you're not a healthy patient. No. That would kill you. Yeah, for sure. I believe that. Yeah. And the reason for that is because you can overstimulate neurons to death. I'm already overstimulated. So, this is why we're going slow with you. <laughs> yeah. Much better. Try this one. Push toward your brother. Go. Much better. Push towards you. Much better. Behind your neck. Just like that. You got the little one, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Good thing. We got something on the front. So when I stroke the patient's right hand, So that's interesting. The patient's having a decreased ability to inhibit sensory inputs. My body just feels a little more nervous than it did when I first came in. Okay, probably from the adjustment on the shoulder. Try this one. Go. Okay, there it is. Try again. Go. Okay, we're going to calm you down. This is a cerebellar exercise. It confuses my brain a little bit. Exactly. It's supposed to. Okay. But it's that's weirdly calming me down though. Yeah. So if we can activate this left side for you, I think we'll get you back to that state. Do this test. Better, right? Yeah, 100% better. <laughs> No 
jerking whatsoever. Yeah. So that's that's how it should be. Yeah, and same with that. I was having pretty bad reactions to that earlier. All right, let's go get you to walk, see how you feel. Thank you for everything you did to me. Kind of a little different, right? 100% different. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go on back.